A few months ago, Pope Francis added three new titles for Our Lady to the Litany of Loreto. It's uh, Mother of Hope, Mother of Mercy, and Solace of Migrants. I think it's a great response to the needs of our times today, to all of the difficulties which we are going through, especially a pandemic of coronavirus, and also our personal difficulties which we have in our lives, which brings Mary very close to them. Mary really lived this great trust in, uh, in God's plan uh, for her in her life from the very beginning. From the moment of the Annunciation, she, she said, let it be done to me according to thy word, today in my whole life. And she was proving that every, every day. We can see it in the moment of a presentation in the temple when uh, uh, Simeon is uh, telling her that the sword that the sword will pierce your heart. Also in the so-called silent life in the, in the Nazareth, and Mary, after Jesus was turning 20, 25, 30 years old, and nothing was happening. Joseph died. She was still trusting in the, in the plan of God that her son will redeem the, will be a redeemer of the world. And uh, at the foot of the cross, in actual sorrowful uh, mysteries which we want to uh, especially I contemplate today, uh, she is there, trusting in this darkest hour of her life in God's plan. There was also one moment in my life when uh, I uh, uh, had the uh, uh, opportunity to participate in the uh, long jump uh, uh, competition, and I was really excited. It was five years ago, and uh, in my first try, ah, I didn't make it well, and then second try. Unfortunately, injury. And the uh, doctor told me, sorry, but it means for you three months without the uh, exercises. So I was really desperate, no soccer, nothing. And uh, actually it was one of the most important moments of my life. Uh, really a gift from God through this difficulty, because I had the opportunity to think about my spiritual life, about my personal life, family life, and Really, without this experience, I wouldn't be here today. So it's just one of my uh, invitations for you today to really trust and uh, hope in the plan of God for each one of you, just like Mary did it.